Slavery disgusts me. Okay, we've been through this many, 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 many times. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Deep Vike and welcome to another episode of my Let's Play Patron series. And again, there is no sound. Yeah, I'm gonna have to redo that. <laughs> you know, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. But, you know, I should keep this going. Not, it's not all that bad, is it? Okay, the first time was the first time. The second time is, you know... It's like, hey, better be a bit more careful. And now the third time, that's when I think I'm gonna cut it. And I'm not gonna show it. And I'm gonna do the intro again. But right now, let's just get into it. So, uh, it looks like we got happiness um, 97 out of 100, which is quite okay, I might add. Education seems to be the highest problem right now, even though that is at 86 in the worst case for merchants. But I presume it should go up because in the last episodes I've been building a lot of schools. And okay, even though we've built a lot of schools, it seems we have problems with resources and exactly candles. We've got a problem with candles. Right, so let's check the candle productions. Now all we got to do is find that candle maker. You know what, let's build the buildings tab, production buildings, and go to the candle shop. We got two candle shops. And I think the candles might not be enough, the production of candles. Uh, no, actually we got some stock, so it's okay. We could also sell some candles, why not? Yeah, sure. Let's check that out. Trade deals. Okay, no room here for any more trade deals. We got one room here. Uh, candles, there we go. Oh, and it has a nice price. So we're gonna export until we reach... Um, steady 1500 candles. I think that's okay. There we go. You know what? Let's check what else we have too much of and just, you know, sell it. Firewood, no, that's never enough. Cotton. Leather, we can sell cotton, we can sell leather. Stone, I don't think I want to sell stone. Iron, what's the deal with the iron? 1,000 monthly used versus 179 monthly produced. That that can be right. Okay, so we got to up our iron production, I guess. There we go. Four more iron miners. Right, so, uh, we should sell leather. Because we seem to have a lot of it. Come on, leather. And it's price is two gold coins, which is not all that bad. And we're gonna check this to 3000 and export only. And you know, let's export wool as well. If it sells for two gold coins, I'm gonna sell it. If it uh, sells for one, I'm just gonna, yeah, three. Oh, but it's at 50, so no, no deal. I think it was cotton, then... <clears throat> Come on, cotton! Cotton sells for two, and that's also great. We're gonna... leave it at 3000 target, and export until we reach 3000. Right. 
<clears throat> okay, what seems to be the problem here? Um. Okay, so we're producing wines. We need grapes. Grapes will uh, surely come. Food. Um, food isn't all that great, but I suppose... What was this? Hmm. It somehow seems that the gatherers, well not the gatherers, the carriers and the general workers don't have enough time to fetch all the goodies to all the production buildings. There always one there is always one exclamation mark around here. Hmm. Okay, so these are empty, they're not growing anything. We might have a food problem at some point. <clears throat> let's see how many empty houses we have. We have only two empty houses. Uh, let's also check the research tree. Start researching some stuff. Duties. We also got gazebo and medium statue but duties is a policy enacting the policy increases taxation on merchants well we could do that <coughs> money seems to be piling up oh and i didn't uh, finish the beautification here on the patron's mansion should i do it yeah sure why not Oh, we got a nice, lovely statue over here. Okay, you know what? Let's put two large fountains. One here and one here. And then... Is there a larger pond than this? No, small. This is the largest. Okay, a large pond. One here and one here, why not? We have a large park. Oh, but I don't have. Yeah, there we go. We got space for that. We can put a medium park over here. And what else do we got? Not much. We got a gazebo, small pond, medium pond that will be researched soon enough. I also have to remember to keep an eye out on the resources, especially on the food while I'm doing this. Okay, so food is piling up, but this is only because it's harvest season. Okay, so let's check that out. It's harvest season and people are starting to gather all the plants and whatnot. Well, not plants, what do you call them? All the harvest, yeah. So there we go, we're researching the gazebo. Now back to the patron's mansion. And I think at the moment we can leave this as it is. And we could put a large fountain right here in the square. Why not? So it's a 6x6. Six six. Okay. 
It didn't uh, destroy only a 6x6 because these are plazas, big plazas, and they destroyed the whole plazas that were inside the 6x6. Okay, so, uh, beautification, large fountain. We're gonna put the large fountain right here, and then we're gonna put the plazas back. There we go, medium plazas. And then we're gonna finish off with small plazas and with stone roads. Okay, so that's not too shabby. Food, yeah, food is okay for now. Firewood is uh, okay too. Iron is going up a bit. I wonder how did we have monthly used a thousand and something iron? Maybe I built something that required iron? I don't know. Medium statue. Right, so I think I should also build another harbor. Docks, it is. Uh, ah, lost. We don't have enough space there. And I think that's it with the. Oh, this could be another spot for the docks. So one here and. In here so what I want to do is build some extra docks for when I start to heavily export stuff and make more and more money and also maybe import some food I don't know yet but we are going to need these extra harbors. A slaver ship is stranded. A ship full of slaves is stranded on a nearby uninhabited island, my lord. Several members of the nobility are on the ship as well. Probably the owners. What should we do with them? Slavery disgusts me. Okay, we've been through this many, 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 many times. So what do we choose? Safety minus 20 for 8 plus people? Yeah, I think... Uh, I think we're going to choose that because safety is just going to go up. It's not a problem. But we have housing shortage now that we chose to accept those 8 people. We will get to that in a jiffy. Let's build the warehouse right here. There we go. And now let's go to this quarter and start building some more houses. A brick mansion. One, two, and three. And four, and five. And six, and seven. And eight, and... Nine, and ten. There we go. Okay, so we did build some extra houses. Now let's check the research tree again. And we are almost done with that, actually. Now, the next thing I want to do is actually produce some medicine. I don't know how you do that. But there's got to be a way.
So how do you exactly do you produce medicine? I'm curious. Big Ranch is researched. Medium Fountain and Medium Pond is next. So again, let's look at these buildings and see what they produce. Gold mine produces uh, gold, obviously. Perfume shop, only perfume tailor shop. Okay, so I can't seem to find medicine. Is it that the herbalists? I really have no clue. Is it a research? You know what, let's go to a herbalist's hut and check and see if we can select something. No. No, we can't. Okay, so I guess we'll uh, leave the medicine for now. Put a small park here and a medium statue somewhere around here. And also a gazebo. And then just fill the rest with plaza and roads. Or should I surround it with trees? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna uh, surround it with decorational trees. There we go. And on this side as well. And there we have it. Now actually let's put some extra trees here in the back as well. And that's about it with the patron's mansion. Doesn't look all that great, actually. I'm not very good at this beautifying stuff. Okay, now let's take a look at... Hmm. No, actually, let's upgrade these arbor... Arbor? Harbors first.
Right, so we wanted to take a look at the... Come on, where is it? Is it J? Is it H? Royal Hall, but what was the... K, okay, so K is the shortcut for Royal Hall. And see what... Um, what do you call these? Decrees we can enact. Something about... You know, actually, production isn't all that bad, actually. Propaganda. We could do with the church and state. But no, actually, we're looking for education. Yeah, so we're going to click on education focus. And I think here we have the details of all the decrees we have enacted and what they uh, give and take. Right. So that's about it for this episode. Join me in the next one where we will start to, I don't know, maybe produce some more fine garments and perfume and start selling that. And I think we will have to increase food production as well. Right. So my name is Deep Vike. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time.